Hi, I'm Snives, and came up with I, I came up with a new method on controlling your PS4. You see, I normally would use DualShock, but there's one problem with the DualShock is that the left analog stick, whenever you pull down, at certain times it will get stuck like like so. So I came up with a way to use the Nintendo Switch Pro Controller without any adapters at all. I only have my PS Vita plugged in to charge. I'm going to show you how to connect up a uh, either Xbox One controller or Nintendo Switch Pro controller and use it on a PS4 as your main remote. And as you can see, it has minimal lag, minimal input lag. So let's get started. First things first, you're going to need a computer with Windows 10 on it. And that's where we're going to start. Now the first thing you're going to want to do is to open up Google Chrome or whatever web browser you use. And you're going to want to look around for a program called VDX. And of course it's going to pop up. Um, right here we have PS4 Remote Play with Working Touch and PS Button. <coughs> So with this, this is usually how to connect a Xbox 360 controller to your PS4 to use as a controller. And what we're going to do is a very similar, similar method, but this time instead of connecting up an Xbox 360, we're just going to set up a Nintendo Switch Pro controller. So you want to get this file. You're going to install it, which I already have it installed. You're going to either use Times 86 for a 32-bit system or Times 64 for a 64-bit system. Another very crucial part to the setup is to make sure that you have a program known as Steam. Steam is a gaming platform for the PC, and I'm pretty sure it's it's very unlikely that you don't have steam but this is what steam would look like if you were to get it and uh you're going to need steam because of its big picture mode compatibility with various controllers such as right now i have a configuration for the pro controller connected to steam which would happen if i went into big picture mode but first things first you're going to want to determine which VDX is compatible with your system. If you have a 32-bit copy of Windows, you'd want to go for VDX.exe. If not, and you have a 64-bit, go for the 64-bit rendition. In the meantime, you'd want to open up Steam at a non-Steam game, go to Browse, hit Desktop or wherever you saved your copies of VDX, and you'd choose the one which is compatible with your computer. Next step is to launch VDX through Steam. The last program you're going to need is going to be uh, the PS4 Remote Play app right here. You're going to want to open that up. And first, before you do that, actually, you're going to want to go underneath uh, VDX in the options. See where it says Player 1 connected? You're going to want to choose DualShock 4 controller and hit Connect. If you looked on Remote Play, it swapped from the Connect Up DualShock to now Start Remote Play. So what you're going to want to do now is you're going to want to press the plus button or the start button on your Xbox and or Nintendo Switch controller. And from there, you're going to be connected to your PS4. Another crucial step which I forgot to mention was to connect the actual controller to your Windows computer. For me, I have my controller set up through Bluetooth. For you, if, if you don't have a Bluetooth card inside of your computer, you would just simply connect the Pro Controller's USB to USB-C to your computer and or the Android charger through your computer to your Xbox controller. But from here, we're now able to control 
the PS4 using a Nintendo Switch controller and or Xbox One controller. It's very helpful in games like Black Ops 3, that's really the one game I found use with it, where the analog sticks would get stuck and it'd be overall terrible to try and aim. But, with, but now, with this controller, you're able to aim with a farther reach in the analog sticks, and it's not as hard to press down on the left thumbstick. I hope this tutorial has helped some of you. I know that it's truly helped me. Um, have a nice rest of your day.